we have an action-packed day today um, and we are also going to be joined by someone special. Mm -hmm. Someone from our friend circle in Manila. Yes. Who is this friend in Manila, RJ? I don't know. Well, I'd like to introduce you to this person. I think you might know. <laughs> it's Tina! <laughs> I missed you guys. Look at you, you look fabulous. I look horrible, but feeling fabulous. <laughs> what time did you arrive in Dubai? Like 3.55 a.m. Oh my and goodness. Then I could do not like half a million people in the immigration line. Let's say I hi know. to my pimples. Hi, it's okay, I have several as well. Oh. Let's go eat breakfast. <laughs> hello guys, hello, hi, nice to see you. This guy's is Rouge Band from Philippines. Welcome, welcome to Dubai. Breakfast was yummy. We're showing them the rooms. This is your room. We said that it has like yes. big washroom. Tina, this is your room. Why is it so big? For you! I don't want to be. And the lucky one. <laughs> Just kidding. That's Bawal. That's not allowed in this country. <laughs> oh my god, Mighty! This place is bad. What is that pretty woman like? My bathroom's bigger than the whole blue banana! <laughs> <laughs> this is a I'm sweet gonna bathroom. Kiss here. You don't have to be <laughs> Alright, we have dance rehearsals. Hello. Hi. With the dancers. Nice to see you. Yes, prices. Cause in the Philippines, where it is very hot. Wow, they learned all the choreo. They're so good. Oh my god, they are so good. They studied. They studied the video to the T. To the T. So prepared. You guys are amazing. Thank you. <laughs> we'll be off stage for this part. Oh, so are you? RJ, this rehearsal will be so fast. <laughs> okay, so for this song, Filipino, we allow the dancers to choreograph their own number. And I just perform the song. And it's kind of cool because it gives the dance group a chance to really showcase their identity and their style. That was the fastest dance rehearsal ever. I love that. Now when we send them the material to learn, it's in the form of a video, and it's choreographed by a professional choreographer from beginning to end. But we require them to learn only parts of the choreo, namely the places where I join them in the choreography. Um, and then if they want, they can just choreograph the spots where I'm not joining them so that it's easier for them. But this group went on to learn all the choreography from beginning to end. Totally blew me away. So this rehearsal breezed by quickly. Guys, look at this hat of Tina. I'm styling. What are you talking about? I like this hat. This is so Queen Bay. You hate us, Coney, with that Illuminati mess. See? We got Beyonce. Look at her. Look at her. Gladiators. Wow. With the hat. Fresh. With the hat. She's ready for the desert. But you know what, guys? She's sleepy and jet lagged. And she wants to cop out and not join us in this desert no, safari. No, it's not that. I have, I have a radio interview, remember? Oh, yeah. That's right. That's show. right. Bye, Tina. So sad. She can't join us because she has an appointment yeah, tonight. Oh, great. Our tour guide from Oasis Palm. Thank you, Oasis Palm. Desert safari. I can't wait. So guys, apparently in this area, the sand color is beige, but where we're going, it's uh, a red color, and the sand dunes are higher, and the sand is a lot finer. Now I asked if it ever gets cold here, and he said yes, it gets down to 32 degrees. <laughs> That's cold for them. Um, there's no winter here, it's always hot, and sometimes it gets as high as 45 to 50 degrees Celsius. Isn't that crazy, my boy squad? It's just insane. Guys, look, it's a date farm. So the dates that we ate in Qatar, that's where they come from, those trees. All right, guys, we're making a pit stop because we have to use the bathroom. Because he says we gotta use the bathroom because there's no bathroom in the desert. But as far as I'm concerned, the desert is a huge bathroom. But we're also um, deflating the pressure on the tires because apparently doing so makes 
off-roading easier in the desert. Like, this car will be driving through the desert and all the sand dunes and stuff. That's crazy. See, they're releasing the pressure from the tires. Guys, look, I'm wearing the Kandura. Kandura? Yes, Kandura. Mmm. All right. Look at that. Styling. Love it. I'm ready. Look at RJ. Alright. <laughs> RJ is making Tawad. RJ is a master at making Tawad in other languages. I'm changing mine. I saw RJ's and I'm like, I want the red too. I don't want to be monochrome. Alright. And it matches my glasses. And the finishing touch. Yes. All right. Love it. We're doing it Arab style. Yes. All right, guys. We're out here in the desert. Look at this place. Wow. Isn't this crazy? Oh, it's amazing. Look at this sand. Oh, it's so. Oh, it's so fine. Wow. Unreal. Look at this. It's just desert. Desert. And dunes. Wait, I want to walk to the plants. I want to see what kind of plant life lives here. Hey, there's garbage and slippers. I don't like that. I want to see what kind of plants live here in this arid desert. They said it rains here about five times a year. Guys, like, if that's the case, these plants need to be able to retain water for a long time. Whoa. The leaves are hard. This is gr it looks like a kind of grass, but the leaves are hard. And I bet you the roots go way down. Yep, it feels like it's really secured in there. What's this? Let's look at this. Ooh. The leaves are really they're thick and they they feel like dry. Wow, what's this? <gasps> this one's germinating. Cool. Look at the pods. Interesting. Oh, this is the grass, but it's just producing its seeds or whatever. Cool. This is great. See this tree? Up. Oh, sand's getting in my eyes. Bamboo High Squad. Ooh. Oh, wow. What a tree. It's just like long tubes. Ooh. And little tiny flowers, which means it pollinates. But what would pollinate this? I wonder what insect. Hmm. Ooh, man. You know what's weird? I imagine what would happen if I was stranded out in a desert like this. <laughs> and you know what? I want to see what animals live in the desert. But I bet most of them come out at night, which is perfect because we'll be out here till the evening. Hey, there's a butterfly. What? Which means there must be caterpillars here somewhere. Wow. Look at that. Look at how tall this sand dune is. See my shadow? See how far I am? Mabu High Squad, this is great. And you know what, surprisingly, even though it's burning hot out here, wearing this kandura, it's not hot. Like, it's so light and it breathes well. Like Mr. Atala said in one of our previous vlogs. Arabian nights like Arabian days. And you know, it reminds me of all of the stories that, you know, I read as a kid during Bible class of Jesus and everyone else who would travel through the desert for 40 days and 40 nights. Imagine being out here for 40 days, 40 nights, where he was tempted by the devil, right? Man, I have so much sand in my shoes. Okay. Hey, my boy squad, I'd like to introduce you to two friends of ours from Melbourne. Hi, hi. Melbourne. Yes, yes. You didn't and pronounce it right. Melbourne. <laughs> Melbourne. <laughs> That's right. And your names? Nicole and Mia. Nicole and Mia, yes. I want to see creatures. Like, I want to see insects. I want to see spiders, venomous snakes, scorpions. That's what I want to see. Camel spiders. Okay, guys, so apparently we're doing something called dune bashing now. So, and we have to wear a seatbelt. I wonder what that is. Okay, here we go. Ooh. I love that we're off roading. All right, we got music too. Oh my god! What? Whoa! Whoa, we're on a pretty big incline here. Are, are you sure this is safe? Whoa! 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 Oh my god, what? Sir, that, that's safe. Please. Oh my god, he's gonna tip over! 
Squad, look at all of those hills. <gasps> Whoa! Whoa! Whoa. Gosh, that dune bashing was crazy, oh, it's right? Not, it's not. I like it. I enjoyed it. I mean, it was fun. See, there are even some rocks up there. Wow. Crazy. So I see a bunch of like greenery here. So these grasses that we saw earlier, they seem to be growing in patches, which I'm assuming means the ground is moist here, like under in this part of the sand dune. Cool. See this plant here? Awesome. It looks, oh, the, the leaves are so dry. I wonder how deep I can dig until I feel moisture. Let's see. Let's dig, dig, dig. It's hard to dig. Every time I dig deeper, it caves in. Well, the sand is definitely darker down here, which I'm assuming is because it's more moist. So these plants must be able... See, these are the roots of the plants. It goes really deep. Interesting. Yeah, see, I'm starting to feel a little bit of moisture in the sand down here. Interesting. So, deep in the ground, there is moisture. There's like, cool, there, there, there's moisture that these plants can drink from. Interesting. Okay, I'm going to cover it whenever you guys go and disturb nature. It's always good to try to leave it back the way you saw it. Oh my gosh, wow! You can hold the bird of prey! <gasps> falconry! They do falconry out here. This is amazing. Is that a falcon? Yeah. It is. <gasps> see guys? And they put blinds on it so it can't see and it get so it doesn't get scared and fly away. Thank you. I love falcons. Guys, look at this. It's a falcon. It's, what kind of falcon is this? Wow! You know what the fastest traveling animal is? It's a peregrine falcon. These can fly very fast. It's amazing. Isn't that cool? What does it eat? Meat, only meat. Only meat. Chicken? Yeah, chicken. Raw or cooked? Raw? Wow. Awesome. There is seriously so much sand in my shoes right now. But this habitat is pretty amazing. What's up my boy squad? I'm trying to do a Facebook Live and we're trying to vlog. And we're riding a camel. That's right! Woo! Isn't this camel cool? I love it. I wonder if it's a boy or a girl. I love it. It's awesome. 
we need internet out here. We're gonna what plug our show. By the way, the concert is today. What died name back the Okay. Whoa! 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 Uh, oh my goodness. RJ, did you drop? <laughs> no. Holy. Gosh, I almost dropped my you cell know, there phone. Was something here. Crazy. Put it in your Whoa, guys. We're riding a camel. It's quite high. Like, this is higher than a than a horse. Wow. Oh, the camel doesn't want to go. Uh, wow. This is cool, my boy squad. Ooh, look at the camel's head. Oh, he didn't like that camera. Sorry. Sorry there. Wow. Oh my gosh, this camel here is right so close. Hold tight, lean back. Okay, we're holding tight. Sit, sit. This thing rises so fast. Sit down. Oh my god. Whoa! There you go. Wow, this thing is. That was not a soft landing. I am so sorry. Look at how large that animal is. That is a huge animal! Look at it! It's humongous! Wow! Oh, it's not happy. Oh, I, I almost feel sad for the camels. But you know what? Camels have been domesticated by humans for thousands of years. Like, I mean like dogs. It's, they, they, there are some camels that can't even breed themselves. They can't mate on their own. They need a person to insert the camel's male penis into the vagina of the female camel. That's how much they depend on humans. All right, so we're here in like some, like, <laughs> establishment they've built. There are ants over there. Ants? Okay, I gotta see what kind of ants live in the desert. Let's see. Chances are, I won't know what species it is, but... Ah, uh, oh, it's way down there. Oh, here they are. What is that? Let's grab one. I bet they sting. Ooh, what kind of species is that? I don't know what that is. Wow. Wow, look at this. Awesome. Oh, they've got a bar. We need alcohol, we got a bar. Interesting. I think I'll take this one right here. <laughs> yeah. A music room? What happens in a music room? Hmm. I don't want to go in. Ooh. RJ and I are going to sit down. Cool. Love it. We're just going to sit down here. All right. We got refreshments. We got coffee and tea. Perfect. Thank you, sir. Where are you from? Pakistan. Pakistan. I, a lot of people are from Pakistan here. Oh, I see. Sponsored by Pakistan. Awesome. I know some Urdu. Tumari kubsurti mere dele Yes, yes. I just know the useful stuff. <laughs> Frying fish? Mmm. <gasps> Yum. Hey, we had some of this yesterday. Mmm. Samosas, vegetables. How is it, RJ? Good. Fried fish, samosas, fried veggies. Let's take this to our table. I love that we're sitting on the ground. We have dinner actually later. Can you believe it? We're eating dinner out here in the desert. What do you think of the experience, RJ? Mm -hmm. Wow. This is one of one of the great experiences I've, I've experienced. Mm -hmm. It's amazing. Mm, this is really good. Let's try the samosas. Mmm. Samosas are good. And see, I've been eating samosas in Toronto and stuff. In the Philippines even. But it's the context. Yeah. So the samosas taste better, right? Right, I agree. We're out in the desert. Guys, let's try the fried fish. Mmm, mmm. So good. Mmm. Love it. Mmm. That's good fish. It's amazing. Really cool. Remember Blue Squad? And guys, we are totally, totally grateful to you guys for watching. And we love taking you guys around. This is just awesome. So happy you're joining us. Eee! My boy squad, we promise to always, always take you along with us wherever we go because without you guys, we wouldn't be here, right? We do this for you. My boy squad, the best squad, the only squad. 
all right? You hear that? You guys are the best. And if you aren't part of the Mobohoy squad yet, meaning you're not subscribed, be sure to hit that subscribe button. Mm -hmm. Be sure to like, share, comment, and all of that good stuff, right? In case you guys are new, we upload to this channel every single day. That's right. Also, a super thank you to Oasis Palm Tourism for sponsoring this entire crazy experience. If you guys want to come to Dubai and you want to do all of these crazy tours, check the description box. I'll put a link to their website so you guys can check them out and do this kind of stuff. Yeah. Oh my God. Look at this animal, guys. It's just beautiful. <gasps> it's chewing its cud. Oh, I'm afraid. It stopped chewing. It stopped. <laughs> this is such a large animal. Look. It's huge. Okay, he's chewing again. Wow. Oh no, I think it, it's got a garapata. It's got a tick right there. I want to help it, but I'm afraid. I don't want to upset the animal. Wow, its fur is so coarse. Incredible. I love its fur. You're amazing. I could just be here forever and pet this thing. Uh-oh, why is it looking at me? I'm afraid. Mmm, dates. Yes. I love these dates. These are the only dates that I like. Mmm, sweet. So yummy. And we have a seed, a pit. You can eat the rest. Ooh, there's a performance, guys. This is special. Wow. Wow. That's so cool. He's a spinning disc. Wow, guys, this guy's been spinning for like four minutes. He must be so dizzy. Wow. Okay, seriously, this guy has not stopped spinning since the beginning of this song. It has to have been six minutes. Hey, wow. Holy, that's so cool. Whoa, that's awesome. What? Crazy. Wow. 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 Unreal! That looks awesome! Crazy! Look at that Mabuhay High Squad, isn't that amazing? Wow, isn't he must be so dizzy? Imagine training for this dance. <laughs> I mean like learning how to dance like this. You must be able to spin and spin until you just don't ever get dizzy anymore. Wow, he stopped. That's crazy. Wow. Wow. That looks so cool. All right, time to eat. Here we go. It looks like a cucumber salad. Mmm. Awesome. That's it. Ooh, tomato salad. Oh, tabbouleh. It's chopped up parsley. Um, it's got lemon. I used to love eating this. Quite a few veggies there. Let's leave some for the planet Earth now. Of course, we love our hummus, right? Mm, feta cheese. We got rice. Gonna skip that. Vegetable curry. Oh, lentil. Vegetable curry. Saute vegetables. Oh, yes. I'll have veggies. Mmm. All right. We got our breads, but I'm gonna skip that. Here's the good stuff. Mmm. <gasps> Thank you. Thanks. Mmm. They've got noodles and pasta for those who might not be open to some of the other cultural food here. Mmm. This is a feast, Mabuhay Squad. Yes. Let's try this chicken. Mmm. Oh my gosh. Did you try this? So good. Yeah. 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 Mm. Yeah. Mm. So yummy. Is the rice okay? Are these baked? Mm. This chicken though is so good. Mm. All 
right, I killed that. That was yummy. All right, guys, now I'm going to lie down. It's kind of sweet now. Yes. It's actually quite nice in the night out here in the desert. It's like the perfect temperature. This is like exactly room temperature. Yes. Wow. Dancing. Beautiful. Wow, how's she doing that? Oh my god, guys. Look at the size of this ant. It's huge. <gasps> what is that? I think it's a Campanata species. Look at how large that is. That's awesome. <gasps> what species of Campanotus though? Unbelievable. See, I was right. They come out at night, most of the creatures, because it's cooler. It's not so hot. Wow. Amazing. Qu that's, that's bigger than North American Campanotus. Wow, more of these smaller ants. Again, don't know the species. All right, we're heading out. Oh my gosh, don't tell me we're yeah. doom bashing in the night. Are you serious? <sighs> yes, another day in Dubai. <laughs> so cool. Okay, so guys, RJ and I have something really great to tell you. Mm -hmm. yep, yep, yep. And that great thing is that we have come up with some winners. And these winners will be getting a special, special prize. In a previous video, we asked you guys why we should choose you to be in an upcoming video, in a special video that we're shooting at a YouTube pop space. That will be on May 1st, mm -hmm. uh, 1 p.m. That's right. So we went through the entries and there were so many entries, mm -hmm. right? Um, and originally we were just gonna pick two people, but instead we resolved to each pick two people. So four people in total will be winning this cool opportunity to come hang with us and um, be in one of our videos, which I think is cool because who would be better to have in our videos than Mabuhay Squad, right? Mm -hmm. um, and so I'm gonna read my two winners first. Here we go. My picks are as follows. 